took the relationship from 2010 to 2013, those college years, those were tough years for us. Yeah, very tough. Tough for us to, you know, we're, we're both young. We're in mm-hmm. our early 20s. I'm on the basketball team. We're immature. And we really don't even know what we want for ourselves, let alone our relationship. The relationship, yeah. So we were so, just kind of blindly going into this relationship like, well, let's see if it works. Yeah. And not really deciding that we want to be committed to each other. Yeah. We were just kind of doing what we thought was supposed to be the the next step. Exactly. But it really just comes down to, and we actually mentioned this in one of the other conversations that we just recently had about building on moments, building on experiences, building on different moments of a Mm -hmm. relationship and and times together. Mm -hmm. And that building the foundation of what you and somebody else can be, what you and a partner can be. Right. And, building on good times and bad times and things that you need, you can, you can work through and all the success and the fulfillment of doing different things together. Yeah. And I think we built so many great moments and so many fun moments and realizing who we were and then having deep conversations too. Yeah. And knowing who we were individually and realizing like, man, we have a lot of common. Yeah. We have, we can really relate on a, a lot of things, you know, deep things like yeah. family history mm-hmm. and sympathizing and, and empathizing with somebody mm-hmm. is a beautiful thing in a relationship. Of and course. I think we were able to do that early on and that built the foundation of who we are today. Yeah. And it's taken time, but with each year of our relationship from year one to now year 13, we have continued to grow. Yeah. And we've continued to, to build mm-hmm. onto something special. And now 13 years later, I'm thinking like, wow, like we have a baby on the way. Yeah. And you know, we're, we're, mm-hmm. we're starting to see what God's plan was all along. Right. Cause we, uh, we obviously did not see the plan he had for us in the, in the very beginning. And not. most people, and most people don't. And I think that's the beautiful thing about how faith works is that, we think that we're in control of situations all the mm-hmm. time and, or we think that we're supposed to know how how the plan is going to turn out and that's not the case at all and god obviously had different plans for us we went into the relationship at the very beginning at 19 and 20 years old just very blindly and very immature and not really thinking about what the future holds long for term. us and not thinking about long term but one thing that we did have that i think god obviously knew early on is that one, we were friends first, right. which definitely helped because we were able to connect on a level just outside of like intimacy and the infatuation and looks and all of that stuff. And then two, we developed a level of transparency with one another. So conversations like this, I think are super important because as new parents, we have to really evaluate ourselves and us as a couple.